Hey, you kids! Quit smashing pumpkins! You be good, or the boogeyman will get you! Having the party tonight. It's perfect. You don't really believe it's haunted, do you? <laughs> I hope so. Come on, let's go get Baxter. like your typical teenager, but this kid has one of the most dangerous after-school jobs going. I should know. I'm Baxter's boss. The government calls me number two. You see, Beans Baxter is a spy. Not even his mother or little brother knows he's working on the side. If they did, it could endanger their lives. His father was one of the network's top couriers until the notorious terrorist organization, UGLI, headed by the sinister Mr. Sue, kidnapped him. Now it's up to Beans and the network to find his father and destroy UGLI's plans for world domination. And if you think it can't be done, then you don't know Beans. The New Adventures of Beans Baxter is brought to you by AT&T, the right choice. Thank you. Ken Avery, big promotion, important project, you're really on the go. Next step, VP. But didn't your client just stop you from using her phone? Oh, minor faux pas. Uh, once she found out that you were calling Nome, Alaska? Well, at least I asked. And you should have used your AT&T card. Really? With your AT&T card, almost any phone becomes your phone. Just dial zero plus the number you're calling, then your card number, and your call is billed to your phone. Great concept. To get the AT&T card, dial 1-800-CALL-ATT. When two ghosts... What's the good of being a ghost if you can't frighten people away? ...can't talk the living into leaving their house. They're dead. It's a little late to be neurotic. They call the ghosts... Beetlejuice! ...with the most... Yeah! Can you be scary? What do you think of this? This is amazing. Michael Keaton... <laughs> is a ghost called Beetlejuice. And the ghost with most babe. Rated PG. Soon everywhere.
the time yet. No peeking. <laughs> We've been working on this all day. You gotta wait and take in the full effect. All right, ta-da! That's terrific, guys. Why, oh, I bet that's the most original costume of this or any Halloween. You were right, Bean. It's much better than the Charles Manson idea. Let's get a move on, Scooter. There's all kinds of treats waiting for you. What do you say we tried on some Halloweeners? Happy hunting, Scooter. You gotta stop doing this. Pretty scary, huh? What's with the getup? It's Halloween. Actually, I'm undercover. In my house? In your neighborhood. We're helping out the FBI. Apparently, Jackie Gardner escaped from prison last night. Jackie Gardner? The Gardner of Death, the All Saints Slayer. AKA, the, the Pumpkin, Pumpkin Princess. We figure UGLI helped with the breakout. What Mr. Sue wants with a notorious lunatic like the Pumpkin Princess, we can't figure. Whatever it is, it's gonna be a scary Halloween. I hear she killed people just for wearing green. Green, yeah. Her mother forced her to eat broccoli when she was a kid. She hated it and snapped. It happens. So why don't they just cancel Halloween? We'd have a panic on our hands, Beans. But nobody knows she's escaped. And we figure she'll quickly give herself away anyway. You see, the Pumpkin Princess has an insatiable sweet tooth. She's overdue for a monster-sized candy scarf-out binge. Well, tonight's the night for that, all right. Keep an eye on things for us, Beans. I'm always close by. Beans, hold up jungle warriors. Make us late for party. Who's the bloodsucker? Ah, uh, it's just leaving. Bye, Dracula. Bye-bye. See you, Drac. We should really put an age limit on this thing. Come on in. Beans, you haven't even mentioned my costume. What do you think? It's got some great spots. Yeah, I think I'd skin her myself. Thanks, Woodchuck. It's sharp. Wood sharp. So, where's the pumpkin carving party going to be? They're having the party at Jackie Gardner's pumpkin farm. It should be very creepy. Gardner? The pumpkin princess's old place? The murderess. I need to be held very close. I lead the way. Isn't this a fun Halloween? Okay, Scooter, let's hit the Jacob's house. Oh, Mom, Mrs. Jacob's never asks good stuff. I know she's a little strange, but a treat is a treat, and you shouldn't look a gift horse in the mouth. <laughs> Another Gumby costume. They're very popular this year. Trick or treat. Here you go. What's this? You know, with all this candy eating, you're going to need this later. How very thoughtful. How very depressing. Here you go. Thank you, Mrs. Jacobs. <laughs> This is our first try, Scooter. The times are strange. I guess people are a little scared of handing out candy anymore, but don't worry, we'll get those teeth rotten yet, okay? Cool, Mom. Dance with the jungle woman. I'll be there in just a minute, Kate. I... You look nervous, Beans. Is it the ghost haunting you in this pumpkin patch? Or is it me? Well, it's certainly not you, Kate. And what are you afraid of? <laughs> 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 
Hey, girl. It's a kick. I'm sorry. What is wrong with you, Beans Baxter? I just had a strange feeling we're being watched. Beans, this is a pumpkin patch. The only thing watching us here are, well, pumpkins. I guess you're right, Kate. I'm sorry. Come on, let's go back to the party. They're partying in my pumpkin patch. Can you believe this? Hundreds of stomping on my precious pumpkins. Nice. You shall have your revenge, pumpkin princess. Call me Pumpkin. Thank you, Mr. Sue Baby, for breaking me out. Your techniques in combining black magic and modern science may prove invaluable to me and my, shall we say, future plans. Of course, we need some proof of your skills. Oh, Susie. Don't call me that. Sorry, Mr. Sue. You want proof? I'll give you proof. Would you be interested in looking over our low-interest, semi-annual, low-equity homeowners policies? With a fixed rate, including homeowners and life. Let's talk premiums on a 10-year plan. Thailand! By crossbreeding pumpkins with these two insurance salesmen, I have created the perfect zombie slave. Finding the proper hat size must be a real pleasure. You guys must really blend in with the crowd and those disguises. Where can I get a melon mask like that for my head? That is his head. My clumsy friend will repair the damage. Please to continue, Princess, with your, uh, shall we say, exhibits? This is my most beautiful botany work to date. I have combined the slick aerodynamic beauty of your average melonous oranges with the unrelenting fierceness and loyalty of the American pit bull. I have created the ultimate Halloween trick. <laughs> a pumpkin that attacks children. One bite from my baby's teeth and you're infected with a rabies-like disease. What kind of disease? My pit pumpkin carries a disease only found in vampires. Vampires love what they destroy and destroy the ones they love. Mm. If we could replace all normal jack-o'-lanterns with your pit pumpkins, this disease would wipe out all who love. In order to survive, you'd have to hate everyone. I hate everyone. And only I Princess, it's so hideous I could kiss you. <laughs> Maybe not. We must find a host for our new disease. Someone who will spread it with an aplomb we will greatly enjoy watching. Well, looky, 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 who have we here? Yes, my friends, this will be a Halloween not soon to be forgotten. <laughs> Don't let Fox Wiggin pass you by. Richard, don't be ridiculous. I would never think of looking at another man. Oh, you're right, honey. How foolish of me. Go past the 20th century, oh yeah. Don't let Fox Wicked pass you. Yo, Fox Wicked! Bye.
Fox. You better believe it matters to me. Consider Fox the Rodeo Drive of the airwaves. Can you get any classier than this? <laughs> well, Rube, looks like you made it to the top. <laughs> Don't let Fox weekend pass you by. I do believe in werewolves. I do, I do, I do, I do believe in werewolves. Now I know why they call this place Fox. Look at that, Thank you. This is Epcot Center. Epcot Center. There's nowhere else like it in the world. For a free color magazine, call 1-800-55-EPCOT. Imagine a Disneyland as big as the city of San Francisco. A Disney World with a surprise around every corner. 43 square miles of tropical paradise. Championship golf courses and the incredible Epcot Center. Imagine yourself here. Walt Disney World in Florida. As big as imagination gets. For a free color magazine, call 1-800-55-EPCOT. are giving out gaskets to 1968 Ford Falcons. Well, Scooter, Mr. Fisher owns a service station. I guess it's just his way of giving out something that pertains to his business. Come on, let's try the Shankmans. Mr. Shankman owns a fertilizer factory. How about the Finkelsteins? Gotta kiss her eventually. What if she doesn't like you? I mean, what if she laughs or, or screams? Better she screams than yawns. <laughs> Beans, let's take a walk in the pumpkin patch. It's very creepy. Like I said, I need to be held very close. Good luck, Beans. Any more potato chips? Okay, can we go back? I got a really weird feeling about this place. Means you don't really believe the stories about the pumpkin princess, do you? But if that's what it takes to get you to put your arm around me, then. Huh? Tank, look out! Is this a joke? Is that you, Woodchuck? Way to go, Baxter. Gosh, it looks like we've got a dilemma here. Who's Baxter, my buddy and pal? Would you be interested in looking over our low-interest, semi-annual, low-equity homeowners policy? They cover homes. What? Good Lord. Headless insurance salesman zombies. What's the matter? Oh, sorry, Scooter. They're hotel soap bars. Oh, cool. Oh, he's a lovely one. It's a shame we'll have to destroy him so quickly. Who are you? What do you want with me? Fella. 
No, no, Putin. It's not I who wants to harm you. It's him. Happy Halloween, young Baxter. You and my vote for scariest mask, Mr. Sue. <laughs> oh, really? I'm glad to see you still harbor your father's sense of humor. Let's see how funny you find this. You never know when tragedy can strike. A simple homeowner's policy isn't always enough. You know, Gord, you're absolutely right. A lot of people are confused about their coverages. Oh, silence! Let her go! She has nothing to do with any of this. She will soon enough. Princess, be so good as to release your... How shall I put this? Salivating squash onto young Beanser's bespotted bimbo. <laughs> Tonight will be the pumpkin's revenge. No, Mr. Sue. Tonight will be pumpkin pie. There'll be no more of your tricks tonight, Princess. I'm sorry, Susie. Don't call me that. And it's been a real treat catching you, Mr. Sue. I think not. Looks like you maimed the wrong melon or two. Now, stay back, everyone. Or I'll unleash this creature on Miss Gardner. But I love you. Oh, you do. Oh, 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 I thought you had something. You had something, my sweet. And now I have my freedom. Adieu, ma chérie. And to all of you, it's been a real, how should we say, treat. <laughs> Untied the girl. Obama, you cover those pumpkin heads. The rest of you, spread out and destroy any jack o' lantern you find. Broccoli. Ah! Police emergency, we need your help. If you see a pumpkin, you must smash it. I repeat, destroy them all. It's a matter of life or death. I knew this was gonna be a great party. Kids, if you see any pumpkins tonight, smash them, all right? I gotta find Mom and Scooter. I'll make that packet of jello for your dinner tomorrow night. I'll even put fruit in it. <laughs> now, Scooter, you never know when you might need wash and dries. I think Mrs. Ackerman was just trying to be helpful. Yeah, I guess. Look, how about we go home and I make you a nice, humongous ice cream sundae? With potato chips? Sure. Oh, come Watch out! Beans! 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 Oh, it's a uh, rabbit squirrel, Mom! They're running more than the police. I'm looking for... Go! Oh! Uh, you, you hurry on, too! All right! I just got to have to kind of stay on them. It's going to hurt me. What more is going to hurt me? <laughs> what has he been doing? Trick-or-treating or looting? Outrageously right, kudos, granola snacks. Reason, teasing, kudos, I'm yours. I'm yours! Nutty fudge, chocolate chip, or peanut butter. Kudos, you won me over any other. Electrifying, granola fire. Simply nutritious, outrageously delicious. Kudos, I'm yours. I'm yours! 
you could have. For Toyota quality and get a truckload of free options. Chrome bumpers, free. Style steel wheels, free. Sports striping, free. Full carpeting, cloth bench seats, all free. $630 worth of free options on Toyota limited edition 4x4s. Priceless Toyota quality and free options. Now who's looking out for number one? Toyota. Who could ask for anything more? It's a special day. Forget it. I'm not going. Why not? Was he invited? Come on. I'm inviting you. On days like this, special days. More women trust Tampax than any other tampon or pad. You gotta trust somebody. You gotta trust somebody. Tampax, even more than protection. <laughs> Your favorite cadet confronts surf and sand. In Police Academy 5, Assignment Miami Beach. Rated PG. Starts Friday, March 18th at a theater near you. And now, a word from a man who refuses to take the Drix Oral his pharmacist recommends for 12 hours of cold relief. <laughs> Drix Oral, the pharmacist's favorite. I've never been so scared on Halloween in all my life. Yeah, well, at least you didn't faint like somebody. I may not remember much, but at least I was there. Where were you, Beans? Hey, like I told you, ask my mom. Rabbit squirrel. It was huge. Jackie Gardner loots at our party. It's unbelievable. I think we've all had enough excitement for one Halloween. I'll second that. And what better way to end it than with a nice slice of pumpkin pie? Here, Scooter. I'll get that. May I talk to you about some low-interest, long-term growth possibilities for you and your family? It's amazing how many people don't understand the necessity for insurance in this confusing world. Tomorrow night on Jump Street, Hanson comes face to face with the supernatural when he witnesses his first miracle. And later tomorrow night, it's Gary Shandling's show. When Gary volunteers to babysit for the Schumachers, can he return their son in working order? Now stay tuned for Mr. President, where Sam's sexy Russian translator has Madeline Kahn seeing red. Next.